What's up people and welcome to this video and yes I know that what's up people sounded really weird I could hear that myself either way in this video guys we're gonna go and play with Roger and we're gonna build the max speed which you can build we're gonna be using the build which we can see on the screen right here gonna be using uh, the moment speed rapid boots which will actually give you the most moment speed out of all the boots and then I'm just gonna be building this wild talker which will actually give you 20% more moment speed for each one of them and I'm gonna go ahead and go against a Yan Shao because Yan Shao also has a really high base movement speed and um, so when I'm stalking him following him uh, he will be able to like run as fast as I am basically and uh, because if you don't really know how Roger works is basically when he is in human form and he uses his second ability he will increase his movement speed by 40% for um, two seconds I think and if he attacks someone, uh, the 40 seconds will still be there. But th don't keep that in mind. I'm not really sure why I said it either way. But <laughs> when you're in werewolf form and you use your second ability, you will gain 50% more moon speed. If there's an enemy hero with under 40% of HP. So that is basically why I have Jan Shao in the enemy team. So basically, I'm gonna be attacking him, dealing damage streams. Here we go. Uh, under 4% and then I'm gonna be in the base I'm gonna use sprint as you can see and I'm gonna use my second ability um, and around after him and you'll actually see how fast that actually is and I have I already added this video basically so I'm just doing a voiceover on this so when I'm looking at this it, it will be kind of weird because now you can see the video sped up by like 400% and then I'm gonna like uh, do it in normal speed and then it, you will get kind of used to like seeing the video in like super speed so will, you feel like well that's not really fast but trust me he is running so insanely fast it's just mind blowing and e even when I have like when the build is done I'm, build, I'm running so fast I think uh, the base move speed without any buffs or anything like that is like 415 which is a lot like that's usually what you get when you use like sprint but he will have it, have it as like a base movement speed maybe that's even more when using sprint I don't even know it's really 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 fast so as you can see the video is sped up it's just because <laughs> we were playing for a half an hour just trying out different stuff and I will be showing you basically basically everything about that okay so the reason why I'm actually doing this is because I have done videos like this before, okay? You guys, if you're a dedicated fan to my channel, you've been watching my channel for a long while, you already know this, okay? I have made one video like this for Saber, and the maximum speed which we hit then was 680, which isn't like super lot when you will go and compare it to this video. And to be honest, I'm not sure why I tried to make that for Saber, it's just stupid because Saber can't increase his move speed, either way. And then I think I, I made it for Karina. Maximum speed for Karin. I think we hit about 700 something, 780, uh, which is still fast. Like it is really, really fast. But today, guys, we're gonna be doing it uh, with <laughs> Roger here, which actually increases his move speed by 50% for two seconds with his second ability, which is just mind blowing. Okay, with Karina, she increases his move speed by uh, 35%. But this guy increases his move speed by freaking 50%, uh, which is just mind blowing. And you will go and see that in a few seconds. So we're basically 12 minutes into the game, and I'm pretty sure we get, I'm getting fully builded in just a second here. And so, first of all, I'm just gonna be showing you guys um, when I'm running from my base using just like um, the sprint and then <clears throat> not chasing anyone just to see how fast it goes I think we go up to like 600 something like that 680 which is still fast okay but it isn't fast enough okay I think we might actually go up to exactly 680 685 something like that so I'm gonna be doing that uh, right about now so you can actually go and see how fast it will see you can see now when I'm standing in, in the base my movement speed is 518 maybe you didn't see it but you'll be able to see it Okay, well, either way. So, yeah, yeah, there you go. 518. Okay, so now I'm just gonna be running from my base and just using the sprint and the uh, uh, buff from the base. So, as you can see here, now you can see the speed is uh, basically usually. So, here you can see 668. Okay, that is with uh, no buff from my ability or anything like that. Because uh, for the second ability to work, you ha have to have like a nearby enemy with uh, low uh, HP, well under 4% basically. So now I'm just waiting for my sprint to go on cooldown, then I'm gonna, gonna do it again, but when I'm in the human 4 with Roger, because it actually works with Roger, okay? He will uh, go ahead and get 4% extra movement speed without uh, anyone being near him, okay? But it's only 4%, it isn't 50%, so it's much more uh, a higher movement speed if you're using uh, when he's uh, in the wolf form basically, so yeah. 
So right now we're just pushing up the towers because uh, later on when we're gonna be doing uh, like the max. Oh look that I was so close on dying right there. Uh, but uh, when we're gonna be doing the full out movement speed, uh, he has to be in my base for it to work. So now I can see I'm in human form. It's 487 uh, movement speed. So I'm gonna be doing it in just a second right here. 487. And proccing the sprinter at 807. Okay, that's just insane. Okay, that's in human form. Okay, which is just stupid. Like that's right there. That's a world record. I never seen anyone else make a video about this or anyone else even trying this. 807. Uh, never done before. But we're gonna be doing it yet again, and we're gonna be having uh, Yansho in my base, which will actually gonna increase my moves by 50%. So yeah, I told for, I was about to say something, but I totally forgot uh, what it was. Oh yeah, right. So basically, when you're in werewolf form, you will actually get like a 10% increase just for being in the werewolf form. But when you turn over to human form, you will lose like 10%. That was why my base movement speed was a lot lower when I was like in just the human form. So now you can see me actually using this second ability just to show you guys that it actually works. So as fast as I jump into like... you Look at that! I'm so fast! I think 620... 2020, 22 <laughs> using my second build right there, like hell a lot of movement speed just from using my second ability right there and you building a lot of movement speed. So he's gonna be trolling around here, well not really trolling around, just waiting for Yan Shao to get his uh, sprint and then we're gonna go and do it in my base. We're actually gonna be failing quite a lot because for him to be in my base and for it to work, he has to have HP under 40%. But the freaking minions keep spawning over and over, so like he has to run out of the base. Uh, to actually just um, make sure so he doesn't die. And by the way, I can actually go and give a small shout out to the dude who actually helped me with this video. He's called Shabazz. I will leave a link to his channel down in the description. You should really go and check it out. He has some amazing videos, right? You can see the minions are spawning and screwing up the videos. And the minions are like pushing every lane as well. So it's really hard to actually do this. But we're going to be doing it actually in just a few seconds right here. Like 3, 2, 1, go. Okay, really soon right now. So he's in the base right now. I'm going to be showing you the base movement speed, which I think is 518. Okay, I, may, I might not show it, but I'm gonna be doing the movement speed right here. So first time when I'm doing it this time, I'm not gonna be showing the movement speed, it's the next time. So you can see, bam, look at this, I'm so fast, it is just insane. So it's gonna be using his ultimate, uh, my second skill is already on cool and stuff like that. It's because it only lasts two seconds, so that was basically why he ran away. So here we can see it once again, but you can see the movement speed is just madness, okay? That's insane, that's a super high freaking movement speed. I'm using both my second ability, my sprint, and uh, uh, the extra movement speed which you get from the base, which is a lot, okay? So that was an insane amount of movement speed. Um, and accidentally Chabas, well the enemy Yan Shao started using regen. So after a while my second build actually stopped working because he has to be under 40% movement speed. But it really looks so weird right now if you take a look at me just running and it's sped up. It looks so weird. <laughs> it goes so fast, like everything is blurred out and everything like that. It looks really cool. So we're gonna be trying it yet again and this time I'm actually gonna be... Um, uh, I'm gonna be showing you guys uh, the movement speed which I'm gonna be getting. So... We will see right here. He's standing in the base right there. I'm gonna be backing off to my tower and I'm gonna be using my sprint and look at this. So running towards him 875 That's the world record. That's the highest moves we've ever made in mobile That is just insane how fast that actually is so you can see I'm actually catching up to him even though uh, Like I only have a two second like uh, lasting on my you can see the 875 really high move speed but my second ability only lasts for two seconds, while Jan Shao's ultimate lasts for like maybe six or seven seconds. So that's why he can be using his ultimate a lot longer, but I have to like switch between forms to actually kind of catch up to him. So yeah. Uh, so we're actually going to be doing something else as well. We're going to go ahead and do some kind of a race. We're going to be running uh, be like next to each other just to see. We didn't really like race. We didn't see who was going to be faster. Uh, by the way, I'm the fastest. I'm faster than Jan Shao. Well, uh... Roger is faster than Yan Shao, but you're gonna be seeing me kind of like when we're racing I'm gonna be like turning around and make like some kind of a spin <laughs> Which yeah, but uh, if you wonder uh, if uh, Yan Shao and Roger would race each other uh, Roger would go ahead and win actually so sadly dear as you saw <laughs> the minions actually killed Yan Shao And we were just dying with that actually happened because we were like what why minions why either way guys So we just have to wait uh, for Yanshao to spawn here again, so as you can see, I'm just clearing the minion waves right here, so they're gonna, not gonna go and win or anything like that. Just taking some buff, doing my business as a wolf, you know. 
So in any second right now, we're gonna run back uh, into battle right here, and we're actually gonna go to race. And you will be able to see right here. And w when we start to race, I'm gonna be doing a spin just because I, I thought I was too fast. I had to wait for him, as you saw there, uh, because if he gets too far away. Uh, I, my second ability won't work, but look at that, look at that, his ultimate is on 24-7 and I'm just switching between right here to catch up to him uh, and I'm gonna be jumping the last bit right here, BAM! So that's kinda cool actually. Uh, and by the way, random fact, if you're wondering how much Yan Shao's ultimate actually increases his uh, movement speed, it increases his movement speed at 30%, so the second ability on Roger is actually 20% more, okay, that's a lot, okay, he increases his movement speed 20% more than what Yan Shao's ultimate is doing, and that's just his second ability, but you do have to have an enemy with low, low HP uh, close to you. But anyway guys, that was basically all for this video, I really hope you like it, it actually took a long time to actually record, as you can see, we're 32 minutes into the game. So remember to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't done it, you can also go to check down Shaba's channel down in the description. But I hope to see you next video guys, but as always, thank you for watching. Bye!